Erectile dysfunction affects a lot of men, and it's basically the inability to have a, an erection that's suitable for sexual activity. Erectile dysfunction is quite common. Uh, it's thought to affect about 30 million men in the U.S. and somewhere over 100 million men worldwide. Men should be concerned or think about seeking treatment basically at any point when their sexual function is not what they expect. Uh, they should be seeing either a primary care physician or a urologist. Hormonal issues can be really important in terms of erectile function, so that may be one thing that needs to be evaluated. Stress can definitely cause all sorts of different sexual dysfunction in men and women, and particularly in men, can cause erectile dysfunction. Erectile dysfunction is often associated with other medical conditions, uh, mainly um, hypertension, diabetes, and cholesterol issues, so it's an important thing that may prompt you to see a primary care physician to talk about other health problems. There are a variety of ways to treat erectile dysfunction. So the first thing we often talk to folks about is um, lifestyle changes. So getting blood pressure under control, um, eating healthy, instituting a good exercise regimen, things like that. More medical treatment um, can be in the form of oral medications. So a class of drugs called PD-5 inhibitors, which are the common ones being like Viagra and Cialis. If that's not working, there are some other options to consider, uh, mainly vacuum erection devices, and potentially injections, and then the most aggressive thing being looking at penile implant therapy. Any patients that have concerns about erectile dysfunction should seek out a referral to see their PCP or a urologist.